I don't feel like it's almost going to kill me, then I can't do it. I'm an adrenaline jump. Charles Flanagan loves to live life on the edge. He's constantly pushing his mind and body to the extremes. And all that hard work has paid off. The Lifetime member is one of the faces of some of the biggest ad campaigns in the entire world. I got in college, I was heavily recruited by Washington State University um, as a track athlete, track and football. And so Nike is in the Northwest, actually Portland, Oregon. So uh, what happened is they saw me, um, they said, you have a great face, you have a great look. And my very first campaign, my reemergence was with Nike. Since then, um, I've been on America's Next Top Model. Uh, I've done a lot of Nike campaigns, done Calvin Klein campaigns. Right now I'm signed with Muscle Farm, so I've done stuff with them. Also, I've done a lot of different fitness and muscle uh, periodicals in other countries, uh, Romania, Sl Slovakia, um, Dubai, stuff like that. Charles' resume speaks for itself, but you don't become the face and physique of some of the most iconic, brand-savvy companies in the world without hard work. And if you happen to see Charles at Lifetime during his work, Workouts, you know that they are extremely, extremely hardcore. Body fat is two percent. So my doctor said, uh, I don't know what you're doing. If I could bottle it, I would. But whatever it is, keep on doing it. I have a very, very regimented, very strict diet. Um, I train uh, six days a week. Everything that I do is not considered normal. Uh, a lot of the trainers, you know, when they're walking by and they're doing their walkthroughs and. Uh, you know, they're, they're showing different members because they do that. Some of the trainers are like, don't do that, don't do that. My workouts uh, include, you know, hardcore weight training. So if it's heavier weights, uh, they include a lot of stability stuff and a lot of stability balls, rope, um, a lot of handstand push-ups, a lot of jumping rope, a lot of sprinting, um, a lot of plyometrics. So things, like I said, that you'd look at and you said, I don't want to do that. If it's one of those things that you consider that I could potentially get hurt doing that, that's what I'm going to do. Charles's techniques and routines may be unorthodox, but you can't argue with the results. He's focused on staying healthy, having fun, living life to the fullest, and having a lot of people see him in major ad campaigns along the way. You know, with this life, um, you only get one. And with the passing of a lot of really close people to me, um, I've seen the fragility of life. And uh, since you only get one, why not live it up? You know, live it to the fullest. You know, at the end of this life, I want to say, you know, I did everything. I stood on top of Mount, you know, Kilimanjaro. I conquered it all.